<laughs> I'm running, not be weary. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You didn't know we did aerobics at church, did you? Hallelujah. You're getting fit at this church. Amen. Hallelujah. Your legs won't get stiff. You won't be on the canes no more. Amen. Hallelujah. He said, go in all the world. You can't go if you're crippled. Amen. You can't go if you're hurt. Your mind's not right. I'm telling you what. This is the year we've got to let the Word of God do the speaking. Amen. Somebody's going through something. Let's pray. I told Pastor Timothy this past year. I mean, that's the first thing I want coming out of my mouth. When somebody starts talking about something, whatever's going on, let's pray. That needs to be the first thing. Let's pray. Praise the Lord. It ain't us anyway. Amen. It says, lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. I can't heal anybody, but I can be obedient. Hallelujah. Lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. I believe that. That's the last 11 words that Jesus said and he went to heaven. You don't think he would lie and go to heaven, do you? Hallelujah. That's what he told us to do. Cast out devils. It's time for some of us to grow up. Amen. It's time for us to tighten our bootstraps up. We've been lollygagging long enough. Amen. We've been trudging through the mud long enough. Praise the Lord. God's got to do something through you. I'm telling you what, we've, we've just been covered up this past year with people dying, people, loved ones, people that we're dealing with. You know, I've got to do a funeral tomorrow. Stacy's dealing with the funeral. You know, all these different things, all the, the loved ones we've lost this past year, you know. I'm telling you what, it don't matter. The girl I'm doing the funeral for tomorrow is 24 years old. Was 24 years old, had her whole life in front of her. It doesn't matter. The devil's killing them at the womb. He comes to kill, steal, and destroy. I tell you what, we have to rise up as Christians and do our part. We have to proclaim the gospel. We can, we, it says that the dead shall go down in silence. The dead shall go down in silence, man. The devil says, be quiet, sit in church, be reverent. My bull argue, man. Come on. I don't say that nowhere in the Word of God. Nothing like honoring God and being quiet before the Lord. I'm not talking about that. But I'm talking about it's time for the people of God to speak faith. Speak faith. Speak what the Word of God. Call those things that be not as though they were. Speak them. Just speak them. I'm telling you what. It works. The Word of God works. You gotta. You don't have to defend it. You don't have to debate it. You don't have to try to win your point over because you know more Scripture than they know and they know more Scripture than you know. The devil knows more Scripture than all of us. All you got to do is just lift Jesus up. Just show some love. Show some joy. Let the Word of God do the walking. Amen. Amen. Like, like your fingers. What was that? Yellow pages? Nobody uses yellow pages anymore, do they? Let your text and do the walking. Amen. Hallelujah. God is good. Do we take up the offering? I hope so. Praise the Lord. I'm looking forward to Pastor Timothy's ministering. And I'll tell you what, be praying for our pastors. Be praying for Pastor Timothy, Pastor Holly, the leaders, the, the elders. I'm telling you, be praying for one another. Amen. Especially those in the household of faith. We've got to pray for one another. We've got to be in contact with one another. You know, I'll tell you what, because the enemy tries to come in. He tries to separate us. He tries to make us feel isolated. Like we're not apart. You're apart. You're apart. Grow up. I tell you what, I believe it's a time to grow up, you know. You don't have to babysit me all the time. Mike, you all right? You all right? Yeah, I'm okay, okay. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Let's get to work. Amen. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Let's get to work. Let's do something. Let's win some souls. Let's win our city. Let's pray for our churches. Let's pray for the other pastors around the community. That God will be glorified in this city. Amen. The blood of Christ will reign in this city. Deliverance will reign in this city. Healing will reign in this city. This will be a city where the marriages don't fail because of God. This will be a city where the drug addicts are set free and delivered. Amen. We're going to lift them up. Amen. They'll recognize it by the sky needle. <laughs> the plane's been dodging it. Amen. Praise the Lord. Let's go to the Lord in prayer.